Quick number four. And, uh, and the guy that was second, Jim. Uh, uh, it's a pretty good race for the team. No, it's good. It's uh, kind of how we've been racing the last few rounds, and well, from the start, I guess, only. So, uh, no, it's good to continue it. We had the breakaways and everything. It was a very fast race. Yeah, no, it's a quick course. Um, obviously, it's narrow, so it kind of like lens going from the front. And, uh, it was just quite good for me to be off the front, uh, keep the pressure on Rob, let the guys have an easy ride. So, uh, no, it's good. Everybody in the team. Doing so well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Max, Tom, all up there. We got four strong riders, so you know we know we could be in the front of these races and give it a good go. And that's what we did again. Yeah, you can't complain, can you? Some lead out from Bostock, and it was a shame we were trying to lead out Max, but it didn't quite go to plan after a little. He had a little bump with Tom Armstrong and lost a bit of momentum but so that was a bit of a shame but okay, yeah we can't complain we want to. How did you find this circuit because this, this has been a circuit used many many times 20, 15 years ago uh, so it's uh, first time I've done it. Um, no, good course. I wouldn't want to do it in the rain, but uh, it was all right today. And, and with the covers, did they make it difficult? Uh, they're kind of tame, but uh, it's, ob it's obviously more difficult than a smooth road. So I was going to say, he's the speed out the covers, keeping, it, keeping the bike stable. Yeah, it just kind of lends like going into it with speed and uh, riding from the front as well. Obviously, the back half's tight and then that's cobble, so it's kind of like if you get to the front like we did, then yeah, people struggle to come around. And uh, the team motto was to go out and disrupt the season uh, in, in the grids, and you've certainly done that. Yeah, we're giving it a good Big go. Time. I reckon we're on. Maybe at least ten wins now, so well, wow. You've won, you've won four in this series. We won at least four in Speed Week. Oh, Cole's won a couple others, and yeah, yeah. I think yeah, ten to fifteen wins is pretty good by uh, by this time in the year. We can't complain. And and the race itself was it? Were you guys in control? Because there was a lot of good tact. I mean, yeah, I'd say know, we Tom were. Tom Armstrong went off, and I'd say we were in control. Really, I'd backed Bostock to win from the group he was in. It was kind of it split fairly early and we had three in the ten or whatever it was, so yeah, I'd say we were in control and with me, Bostock, Max, you know, we always back ourselves in a sprint, so I'd say every scenario we had it covered really tonight. And it helps, you know, when you've got four riders that are strong riders, you can always cover these scenarios. Like there's been times in this series where there's only been two of them and Techers have maybe had three or four and wheelbase had five or six, you know, so we had the number numbers advantage today and yeah, we made it pay. Finally, Matt, what's the strategy? Anything okay, to do with the series? Or just the win? Is it just getting the out in the air? Uh, the series is always kind of in the back of your mind, but oh, obviously, I won the first one, and I, obviously, you got to consider it then. But I had a pretty, uh, pretty shit round in Guildford, which, uh, yeah, 17th there, kind of just, it didn't obviously put me out, but it put me good few positions behind Rob. So uh, no, I've, I've wanted to win with the guys. Like a win's a win, and. The series kind of looks after itself, and yeah, I can't do better than the last two wins, so yeah, give it a go. Forgive me for asking this final question. I had an email from Dr. Hilbert. Apparently, you are one of the riders on the Isle of Man that started in the youth league. How important is the youth league? We have hundreds of riders every week on the Isle of Man racing their bike. Ah, it's, uh, yeah, I can't speak highly enough of Dot, and I can't. Yeah, I don't even know how to kind of. Yeah, but the, the impact it has on all the kids who can go and race uh, a closed circuit with, yeah, there's like 300 people turn out from the age of like five to 16. So. Um, no, I, I had many, many, many great races down there, kind of practicing the tactics that I still use today and obviously it's a, it's a closed circuit so maybe that's why I enjoy the crits, just all the years of doing that with Dot, but nah, Dot, yeah.